What is going on, everybody? Let me move this out of my face. Welcome back. I don't know why I say welcome back. Like, I never go anywhere. But today, we're going to do a video with the LMG, the Dingo, uh, more importantly. And you guys know that I've been trying to go for Dark Matter. I've been kind of slacking lately. I haven't really been playing as much as I wanted to. But um, we are actually playing on Stronghold right now, which is shocking. Because, like, 98% of the time, we get Nuketown. So, I'm actually pretty happy to actually be playing this. So... Thank God for that, because I can't tell you guys how long I've actually played for on Stronghold, unless I'm playing Wagers or something like that. I never play on this map. And uh, this kid's over here, but that guy just got their schmook starting off 4 0. This kid, why are you spawning there? But uh, this gun does take really, 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 really long to load. Um, I don't even think this thing shoots bullets. Like It looks like it shoots like a. Um, like battery or something when you reload it let me just shoot one time like look how long this thing takes to reload that thing definitely doesn't look like a magazine but uh whoo, i am actually going like i was saying before i was going for dark matter uh that's my class right there you guys see i have no attachments whatsoever this gun definitely needs attachments like a uh, quick draw like the main stuff basically what every other gun uses and um fast mag on this thing 100 percent just because like i said it does take really really long but I am not using any per uh, attachments as of now because I'm going for the last camo on this gun, and uh, I can't get any. I need to get kills without the attachments and stuff like that. I don't know where anybody's spawning. I don't know what this kid is doing there. Save my teammate. This kid's coming behind me. I think I just hopped over him. So yeah, it's it's for some reason LMGs to me. Um, headshots are very very hard to get in my opinion, just because it, like they are LMGs. They're not really made to be that accurate. They're just supposed to kill really fast most of the time have a lot of bullets and stuff like that so when you try and go for headshots like there's a lot of recoil in my opinion let me reload this thing really quick so um it's really hard to go for headshots in my opinion but after you finish the headshots which is a hundred you have to get like the policia policia whatever you guys want to call it uh the, that camo the thing like gold to me just flies by because i probably got the hundred camo hey I don't know why I have this. Let me just. Oh my god, I just missed that twice. But. I got the 100 headshots, that's what I was trying to say. And then, after you get the headshots, like everything just flies by. You get every other single camo so quick. You guys saw before, I just got the gold. So, that's gonna look pretty sick once I actually put it on. I'm sure, you got it after this. But. These guys don't really have much gun skill. Like, I just completely destroyed that kid. And, uh, I mean, especially the Dingo, I feel like this was the hardest for the headshots. It's the second SMG, or LMG. And, um, since it has, like, the fastest fire rate, I think it should, honestly. But, uh, since it does, it, um, the recall in it is a lot worse than any other gun. So, I feel like if it had a little bit more, um... Like if you put, if you could put a grip on this thing, do it because and especially do not put rapid fire. In this thing. this thing shoots enough already, so you definitely don't need that. Let me just score this thing really quick. I've never played uh, uplink on this map. That's actually really weird. But I'm shrieking right now. Let me get this. Man, I thought that was a kid. I'm surprised they actually aren't spawning over here. Usually, in uplink, you sp you spawn trap like really really quick because there's only like two spawns on Newtown. That thing's insane. That video you guys saw. Um, like two, three days ago, I don't even know when it was. Uh, with me getting a spawn trap, that was on Newtown, so you guys could see like what you could actually do on with spawn trapping on Newtown and uh, with on uplink. So if you guys are trying to like spawn trap and stuff like that, if you got like a full team that they actually know and this can tie me on the rock and they actually know what they're doing, you just go on uplink because you guys are about to tear their buttholes apart. Let me reload this thing really quick. We got like 50 seconds. These guys are blind. These guys are very blind. I thought that was a person. I might be blind too. But there hasn't really been much like of a challenge this game. It's pretty accurate like I was saying before. I actually did mention that. Pretty accurate. Shoots really fast. Damage on it is pretty nice. Um, the attachments I'd like to run on it. What the hell? Uh, quick draw. Elo. If you want to run this, I guess you could. It's not really that bad. But, um, like I was saying, I have to go for that, so that's why I don't have anything on. This kid's camping in our spawn with a pistol. He did. And, why does it smell like something's on fire in my house? That's probably not good. 
But the round's about to come to an end. Let me just try and chase this kid really quick. Ooh, I actually don't know how I didn't kill that kid. We got 18 and 5, honestly. In Uplink, you're not really expected to drop that many kills. Because the games don't really last that long. So, uh, if you guys are trying to go for like 100 kill gameplays or something like that, don't go in Uplink. And uh, I usually go in Chaos Mafia. You guys know what that is. I used to get like Nuketown all the time. But, um, especially if you're playing with, like, random people, they usually just try and score as much as they possibly can. And uh, it gets really, really annoying. And depending on your teammates, it makes the game last or, uh, finish really, really quick or last really long. So, you guys gotta get the right type of people for that. So, if you guys are actually trying to go for long gameplays and stuff like that, you guys can even want to go for Domination or... Uh, hardpoint. Honestly, like hardpoint to me, probably lasts the longest just because they took the time out of it. Uh, so it'd probably be different. Let me call in some of these streaks. This guy's trying to flank. I don't know where he wanted to go. We got another kid actually trying to flank over here. He's dead too. Now you guys see like how fast this gun actually melts. Like the fire rate. This thing shoots like an SMG, and I'm gonna die. But wow, I really smell like something going on like downstairs. This thing like it's literally sm it smells like something's burning. And let me call that thing in. I really hope something's not on fire or something. Because if there it is, and I'm playing upstairs trying to make a video playing Xbox, that's not really going to look too good. And this kid's trying to hide behind. There it goes, my wraps. I should start getting a bunch of kills, actually. Uh, let me call in this scythe. And I don't know where these kids should be spawning at this point. Like I said, I never really played this map. And it uh, looks like these kids basically just keep trying to flank over and over again. Oh, actually, I don't know if they're just spawning here because we may have just pushed our spawns like to the max. I'm not even gonna bother going for that kid. Kill this kid. Get that extra 100 or 25 points. What? How did that kid just kill me? Master X Onyx? Onyx? Whatever you guys want to say. But this game's actually not lasting. Like I said, Uplink really, really doesn't last that long. And especially since these kids aren't really like putting up a fight with my teammates. Ooh, the hit fire with this gun is really, really good too. Like you guys see right there, that's actually like the main biggest thing with this gun. Like you guys expect like an LMG to just go, you kind of just camp. Like say you're up here, you're basically just gonna try and chill up here and stuff like that. But with this gun, I don't know what that kid was doing. But uh, with this gun, basically what you're gonna try and do is like. You could actually rush around with this gun if you really wanted to. Especially if you had rapid fire on this thing, I haven't tried it because like you don't really need it. But if you do put rapid fire on this thing, that thing would probably be like it would probably shoot as fast as the I want to say the Vesper, but like a little bit slower than the Vesper, in my opinion. I just feel like that's what it would shoot like because without rapid fire, if it shoots this fast, I don't really know uh, like what to expect. So I guess it could be pretty good. This guy should keep running. Where in the hell? But, yeah, so it's pretty pretty fun to use, I guess. It gets really, really annoying, especially without attachments. And uh, what the hell is that guy about to do? That guy just spawned there. I'm sorry. So, um, like I was saying, headshots are really, really hard with this gun. And usually I go in hardcore. And uh, since it is a heavy gun and stuff like that, it's pretty hard to run around, though. So you don't really want to try and do that. game's actually about to end soon. There's a kid over here trying to snipe us out. I don't know what this kid over here is doing. But if I go get this lot, what am I? 41 and 18. Oh, 41 and 8. Let me get this uplink really quick. See if I can smack a kid around. I hate. They still haven't fixed this like speed bump glitch in this game. Well, that was. Let me throw this thing down. Honestly, I don't even care. That kid's probably gonna go for the ball. Kill him. Call him my wraith. Let me pick up this ball just so that my teammates don't actually pick it up. Uh, let me throw it down there for a second. Let me just jack this. Oh, God. And, uh, it's actually a pretty good, like, spawn trapping gun. You guys mostly use LMGs just for that. But, uh, it is pretty good with that. Just in case, like, they do run up close on you. You don't have to, like, actually get caught, like, switching a gun. Since it is an LMG, it's really, really slow with it. So you guys, like, you you can just start basically just spray and spray with it. And uh, hope I just got shit on. Jesus. But like I was saying, you could basically just keep this out at all times. It does run out of ammo pretty fast. Like I said, since it does shoot 
relatively quick compared to the other uh, LMG. Sometimes like mo it shoots like the Weevil, honestly. Now that I think about it, sorry I keep yawning. I don't know what's wrong with me, but um, that's pretty much it. 49 and 10. I, I actually didn't do good at all, but we got damn. What the hell? I our koala on the other team, 9 and 32. Damn, my boy, level five. But damn. But uh, that's pretty much it. Pretty much it for the video. Let me show you guys the gold. Actually, I almost forgot about it. The main point of this video, the gold dingo. That's my class right there. If you guys are like any worried about it. But uh, let me show you guys what the gold camo looks like on it. Alrighty, boys. Let's just go over here to the camo. We got gold. Actually, it doesn't look too bad on it. It looks really, like, pretty dirty, honestly, in my opinion. But that's pretty much it. Uh, I have the BRM done and the dingo. So I got these two. And for snipers, I just need the SVG. I got to unlock that. But I hope you guys did enjoy. If you do, please like, like, subscribe. Follow the social media links down in the description below. See so if we can get to 7 or to 10 likes on this video. Time will be max. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out.